So you're in a Google Meet and you just have to save something that comes up on screen. Maybe it's an important slide, a snippet from a document or an image. Here are two methods you can use to take a screenshot in Google Meet. The first using local hotkeys and the second using free Google Chrome extensions. Let's go. So the first free method you can use to take a screenshot in your Google Meet is to use the keyboard shortcuts to take a screenshot on your computer. I'm in a MacBook Pro. So for me, Command Shift 3 will take a screenshot of the entire window, including what's on the screen in Google Meet. Now, if you're using a Windows computer, that would be Alt Print Screen. Or if you wanna just take the image itself and maybe just get the video frame, you could press Command Shift 3 on Mac or Windows Shift S on Windows. And that'll allow you to take a screenshot portion. Now you should always ask for permission to do this in your Google Meets. But the problem with this method is while it's free, these files will save either in your desktop or in the folder where your screenshots save to, and it can get a little bit messy. That's why it's actually easier to use a free Chrome extension like in method two. The second method is to use a free Chrome extension which will take the screenshots for you. Now, the one we would recommend is our Chrome extension tactic, because all you have to do is click save a screenshot to the transcript and tactic saves the screenshot for you. And what's really, really cool about this is not only does it save the screenshot, but it saves it in context of a full transcription from your Google Meet. So you can see what was said before and after whatever you capture in the screen. This can be really important for when you review information later and you're coming back to that screenshot to see what was said in the conversation around it. And it's totally free to download. The other method you could use with a free Chrome extension is the Meet screenshot, which we haven't personally used ourselves. Now the screenshots you save with Tactic in your transcript are actually saved into a Google Doc and all organized. So you will be able to find them later as opposed to going and looking for the files. So there you have it, two methods to save screenshots in your Google Meet. Number one, by using your local keyboard shortcuts and saving it to your computer. Or number two, by using our free Chrome extension tactic, which also saves a full transcription with the screenshots too. And if you're looking for more information about Google Meet's productivity, please be sure to follow our channel. Thanks.